today uh, I want to surprise my big boss right here. You know, we've been having chat conversation calls back and forth, Charlie, but we know meet before. So today I just surprised him. Once I surprised him, I can't put camera for in top way with the help some nice conversation. Yeah. So, boss, uh, uh, I don't know, but uh, people go ask, ah, especially the new generation, you know, go ask, ah, now ask when. I said, so you be Uluma, you go bring Uluma. I said, no, you don't be Uluma. I'm here with the legendary Zap Mallet, yeah? The songs where they jump, you know. Remember, it's from somewhere. And one of the people who then starts, he be me the day, yeah. My name is DJ Ashman. Boss, good afternoon. Good afternoon, good afternoon. You are most welcome to my humble department. <laughs> nice one, nice one. Boss, uh, this afternoon, as I come here, it no be anything. You know, uh, you know I'm a music person. I'm a DJ. I'm into show business at large. So, so today they make a pass by and talk to my big boss and see how things they go. I came to the studio. Wow, lovely studio inside and so man, lovely studio. But boss, what they happen? Ah, uh, Charlie, as an Nigerian, it's good talk. Happened in nothing. I mean, we all day. We are, it's it's you know COVID season, so mm-hmm. everything too slow down. You know, but. Uh, we still do survive. I mean, it's not it's not been easy, but once we are alive, we give thanks to the Almighty for strength. Nice, nice one. So, uh, COVID and music. How how is COVID treating music for you? Um, COVID has um, obviously the social distancing protocol, the protocols to to prevent and to stop the COVID from spreading, has really uh, is a is a thing that has really. Uh, hurt music to a very large extent because you know music is uh, has before COVID it's been primarily contact. Yeah. It's, it's like a contact sport. You know everything be contact. You have concert. You have to see your people. Your people have to see you. You have to see you. You have to go to radio station for interviews, TV. But you know these days because of social distancing and the protocols we have to keep, it's brought up distancing. So. Things like live shows and things are not happening, and uh, they call something virtual concert, Charlie. I don't know how. I don't know if you go feel jump like, say, you day around people with them, or they jump to some tune. You know, understand that, that kind of thing? Yeah, that energy where they, they jump to some tune, or they, they shout somebody away. <laughs> Can you shout away if you are watching at home? If you are, not, if you are, not, you are watching at home, you know, then. Uh, maybe something else, they go feel develop something else out of it. I don't know, but. Um, it's really, it's really hurt, hurt uh, music, you know, oh. for, to a lot of Okay, okay, okay. So, boss, uh, music-wise, Ghana music, aside co- uh, uh, COVID-19, Ghana music, how do you see Ghana music now? Oh, Ghana music, um, to a large extent, uh, the, 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 the business side has uh, gone up, but the music side has either remained, uh, what it is, or it is even dropped in the sense that the concentration come there, the music, the business inside okay. too much. So you see, the thing be music business or show business. So there's two elements involved. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. There are two elements involved: the music and the business. Okay. First, no, the people they concentrate on the music and leave the business. So you know the jail. So the balance was bad. Okay. That be why many of them died purpose. Okay. Because they didn't take care of the business aspect of it. Somebody, they, I know plenty of people where they write songs, beautiful songs that we have enjoyed in the past. Yeah. Ashman, I know go lie you. People have written and arranged and produced beautiful songs for other artists mm-hmm. or people to put their name to it and to rather enjoy. Mm-hmm. And they, they've died purpose okay. because they didn't. You know, back then there was not that kind of um, uh, awareness, like, okay, publishing, that kind of thing, like today. Yeah. You know, today things have changed. So people, boys are even rushing to get publishers. Uh-huh, but then that thing was not there. Okay. So the, the balance was bad. Okay. It was just the music, the music, the music, the business was terrible. Okay. All they just went to do was, they just go and play some, for the dance band, they go go play some dance. Those days we call them dance. <laughs> Collect some small money, share to the dance men, and that was it. So there was no security, nothing in it. No security, no nothing like, say, oh, somebody could go pension and they retirement. And this, there's nothing in it like that. But today things are changing, you see. The, the business aspect is now people are aware mm-hmm. of it in Ghana. Okay. People are aware of the music, of the business aspect okay. of it. But it seems as if now the business who has overtaken the music. The music. So, so that balance, there, there's another imbalance. 
because people are taking care of the business aspect, they are not paying attention to the music. Mm. So it has affected the quality. Of so it has the affected the quality. Okay. Because right now it can't be like oh, this uh, Samsung uh, A uh, A16 mm. or G5 or whatever. It means they go past, so it means you know we go produce. Okay. It, it's, 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 it's become like it's it's just for the business. How much people are going to buy or how much people are going to follow, and it's not so much of how good my music sounds or how good it. It, or how good I write, yes. yes. Because it's just a matter of just gathering something. something and followers and do something. Just the business aspect of it is is is, is okay. has taken over okay. Okay. right now. So the music part is not the creative part That's, is, is yes, attention who did there again. People need to pay attention to the creative part. Okay. So uh like taking care of uh, like attention to the creative parts, does it mean it has affected our production? lyrics that's the content and oh, yeah, all that. It has affected everything. When I say the, the, it has affected creativity, it has affected everything. So right now, boys go into the studio, three hours he come out with a track. I don't go lie to you, three hours he come out with a track. Mm. Meanwhile, you and I know how long it takes to write a hit or to write a track. Technology has evolved. So. It's, uh, it, technology has evolved, but art is still art. You understand? You understand? Yeah. It doesn't mean that, oh, okay, can you sing a song in one second? No. Yes, you still sing a song. If it's five minutes, it's, you sing it in five minutes. If you sing it four minutes, you still, so if it has to take you quite quite a while mm -hmm. to produce it, mm -hmm. you know what stops you from doing it? Why should you go into a, 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 a? For me, I don't see why you should go into a studio and rush a production. Okay. Sometimes you even need to take a break. Yeah. 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 Sometimes you need to even take a break because creatively, you're a human being. You're not a machine. Mm -hmm. We haven't reached that stage yet. Probably AI. Yeah, maybe, but you know, we are human beings. Sometimes you even need to take a break from what you are doing. You understand? Yeah, if they mix and things, sometimes if I they mix, most times if I they mix, I they take break. Okay. I go take about an hour or two break, go sit down somewhere just around the neighborhood or around the house inside, or they just chill off my ears. Yeah. yeah. So why should you enter a studio and in three hours? Wow, well, I don't know how they go about it. Uh, they will tell you if you you don't come out early, like. You go pass your name, no good day. People them ahead, their trends, you no good day. I think that one is just they, they just a rush, uh, it's just an excuse. I don't, I don't think it holds water because, um, uh, if 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 you see your work, if it's if if it's good, it can also stand there for you for yeah. off, it, it can outlive you. You know, look at people who have who have been outlived by their music. Bob Marley, yeah, Bob Marley died how many years now? 1981. Now. Till now, it's still music it's still day. Lucky Dube, see him. Yeah. Peter touch them all. Yeah, yes, so yes. Cool. you know, because they did good music and their music are, is outliving them. Mm -hmm. But don't rush them because oh, Charlie, because Charlie, my time, my they trend. Okay. Yeah, then if you rush where your time pass, your time to affect your, your, your. So, so, so boss, are they ask, uh, when did this thing started? Uh, uh, well, I, I would, I, I'd say that uh, with the advent of technology, technology has also brought us this far. But you see, uh, I don't think uh, that should be the case. Technology is supposed to aid us. It's not supposed to be our enemy. I don't see why nowadays it's as if technology has become our enemy because technology seems to be taking all our jobs. So it's as if technology has become an, our enemy, but it shouldn't be so. Uh, you are giving the, your your um, your fruity loop, your cubes or whatever, put, to put in your creativity, mm -hmm. to input your creativity. Yeah. If you put in garbage, what will you get? Yeah. Garbage you get. Garbage will come out. Yeah. You understand? So, um, technology was made to aid us, mm -hmm. to help in our creativity. It is not to replace our creativity. That's the difference. So right now, it seems uh, technology has. It's replacing our creativity. So now, pastors today, what happens is that they go on YouTube okay. and go and find anything there and come and apply. Very position myself, but I like this part. <laughs> <laughs> this part, the job is uh, they, 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 they go to They go on YouTube uh -huh. and anything they find there, uh -huh. they come and apply. Okay. Disregarding the fact that the applications mm -hmm. or the the, the, the the settings you are working in mm -hmm. can entirely, in fact, it's entirely different 
from what you saw on the video. video. Okay. The thing we say, because he go see some white boy so or some black American kata boy, they do him. If you come apply him, but that is the difference between uh, applying your skills and just having skills. Okay. Okay. The wisdom to apply the skill it be very very important. Okay. I know boys. I know boys who are very brilliant, who are very skillful. Trust me, ask me. Some of them say, Charlie, when it comes to playing and things, I fear them. But when you put them together as a band, you know the jail. Trust me, I did get some, I did get some files for mixing and things. Where did they bring me a, a whole band? Where if you listen to them, you say, this one, they know be band. They just go pull them together because they don't gel. They are playing. They play very well. But the wisdom to play together, they don't have it. What they call that thing? Uh, it be today trend, like they talk. No? Trend. I, I mean, there's uh, whether I call it a spirit of impatience or whatever. You know, you know our time. Mm -hmm. mm? Mm -hmm. Make I tell you some. As I as we talk, I will tell you a lot of things. Mm -hmm. You see, it be we want our time. Don't forget, say did the man. What time? Yeah. Cast on TV. About net ten minutes. Uh -huh. Fifty minutes. That is screen there, Baba. Okay. So you know, no. You have your own. <laughs> go and ask your mother, I go tell you those times. If you put on radio, 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 radio uh, you know, if I put if I put you on the radio, I get radio. No, 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 no. Like Back in the day, no be like that. Transistor radio, if a transistor radio started coming, as with the grow way, in the camp, then you can you put on all then it come. But those days, no. Okay. If you put on the TV, as when you about touch 10 minutes, you about many vibes are hot, I eat it. Then the TV about going. Then no about TV, no. I'm telling you. Oh, really? Yes. No, we had that patience. We had that spirit of patience. Okay. We had that patience. Oh, that, what were you, that kind of patience? So, oh, at, at the time, which year was this? Oh, I'm telling I'm talking about the uh, 70s. Hey, okay, okay. 70s. <laughs> that way. Yeah. When we were growing up, 60s, so, yeah. 70s. Oh, that. Wow. wow. No, what were you? Well, we get that. Uh, 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 yeah. You know, we, we, we if you sit down, and take any, excuse my language, any garbage. garbage yeah. We are patient. We have that kind of, you know, yeah. hand, that thing. We know the rush because you will sit down for the for your TV to heat up before you could watch anything. Even listening to radio, we do the same thing. But today we are living in a generation where things are fast. Go talk, Google. No, Google self, go talk. DJ Ashman. So, no, everything. I know the Google has been had to go open self and type. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. No, it's it, we are in a digital age. Mm -hmm. No, no fear, no, it's pa, 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 pa. You know, but it doesn't mean, okay, for that, I have to compromise on my creativity. Okay. The way I create is the same way I create, even if it's digital. Mm -hmm. I can't create digitally. I create as a human yeah, being. And then you send it to the And I send it to a digital to give me my results. Okay. Yes, I create, I still create. But you, you see, these boys, they are, they are in a hurry, so... Whatever they, they they put in the technology and they get back, they just take it like that. They don't care how good it, how whether it sounds good or not, or when I, they don't care. Mm -hmm. So that, that that one is for the production, like the beat producers and all that. So, who is a producer? A producer like a music producer. A music producer is actually, um, I don't. We don't get it here. Um, we don't get it right here, especially in Ghana. But the music producer. He starts from he starts with the music with the uh, artist from scratch, even the choice of song. Okay. He's he's yeah, he's involved. Right yes, he's even involved. Now, if I'm producing DJ Ashman, okay, maybe it was a song. Uh, one maybe one love. We are producing a song, one love. Okay, that's the title. Okay. But Ashman, uh, I would suggest that uh, Kemena collaborate ke, if you collaborate with Stone Boy or with uh, Sh uh, Shata or with uh, uh, Fifty Sailor or, or you know or Exo or something, yeah, I go from there. They're okay, we can invite them, make they come. We could write with them or, or what we write, we send give them, make they also add them input. So so even from the songwriting stages, the producer is involved. Oh, okay. Yes, even from songwriting stage, he's involved to the point of finishing to mastering point. He's involved. He is the one who is like. Um, like a film director. Okay. It means they call the shots. shots. Okay. okay. You understand? Okay. Uh -huh. And the sound engineer be the DOP. Oh, the director that, of, product, of photography. Uh, video production. Uh -huh. so 
Uh -huh. it's, it's, it's a DOP. Okay. Yeah, if you go tell you so, this shot be right. We go figure get this angle. We go figure get this from here. Oh, this one, this one will not be possible. This one will be possible. Where the producer be the one? Okay, I want this. Put this for here. Put the bells for here. Yeah. Put the uh, cowbell. Bring them down small. Bring this one up. Uh -huh. Then 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 things. So, so that's why it's easy for uh, sound engineers to double as producers as well. Yes. But here the producers are they not the same as beat makers because that's how we see it. We call them producers, like the beat makers, whatever. We say they are them be producers. Uh, well, 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 to an extent, yes, because they 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 are involved in the making of the music. Okay. Because once it once he produces a beat, yes. he's involved. He's creatively involved in the making of the music. Because the music will survive. That thing where Shatta go come sing for top or Stoneboy, the artist will come sing for top. No go feel survive without into the beat where you make. So it's also part of the creative process. So what about those then they play the beats? Oh, I guess some beat for them. I won't make you can't write for top. Them two, they are producers, right? Well, no, 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 no. They are they are they are not producers because at the end of the day, he just give you the beat, make you go do and whatever you go do, I mean you know they care. But to a lot to to an extent, you know, they will give you they will give him production credits because he was part of the work. So he is also entitled to production credits once he started the work. Mm -hmm. So if he, he said, I get beats, uh, come take him right himself. Once you go you go for that, that beat, beat, it so means you've made yes, you've made him he deserves something out of that song, song. where you go do. Okay. So if that song blows up and becomes a hit, he also deserves something, something out of it. Oh, okay. 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 So what about sound engineer mm -hmm. and the producer? Yeah, like I talked, the sound engineer, the, the sound engineer be like the director of photography. He may be the technical person, he be the technical anchor okay. of the whole job. He go sort you out with your levels, or maybe this one be too high, or maybe with a peak for here, or maybe with a clip for here or something. So we have to come down this. Okay, so what do we do? This thing be too, this thing be too muddy. I know they like the way they kick the sound, the, the way they play them. Um, be too this. Okay, okay. Then if you be so, then make we thin here, small. Make we add this here. The hair. You know, that be the that be the sound. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It'd be very technical. Okay, so right now in Ghana, the beat, the beat producer or the producer, ID. Now the sound engineer. They are work now in our industry at at this stage. It, can we feel it? Yeah, they talk say they, they go YouTube, go learn something, and come put, put them, they come apply them to every setting that they get. Okay. Meanwhile, even the white man voice in texture. Be different from black man in voice and texture. Yeah. Even the black man said for America, in voice and texture, different past uh, black, man for, black man for Africa. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh yeah, there's something we call timber. timber. We call it timber, yeah, T I M B R E. Not timber as in B E R. Uh -huh. B R E, okay. timber. timber. It's, 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 it's kind of like the color of your voice. Oh, okay. our, color, our color of voice is different because they are in temperate, don't forget, say they are in temperate climate. climate. It's colder, but over here it's hotter. Okay. Uh -huh. So some treatment you go feel give some some artists for there. Nobody that same treatment you go feel give uh, artists uh, for here. Oh, okay. Yes, but okay. because they go and learn from YouTube and things, and so they apply it by heart without regard to the fact that Charlie, you have to consider that, you know, uh, because uh, every song and uh, even even when you are mixing every song. And the impact you wanted to create, and the, the impact you wanted to create also depends on the instruments, how you mix, mm -hmm. how you how you. Somebody maybe be reggae. You want you want the emphasis to be on the striking. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. It go depend on how you go do and how you go put the uh, and balance the things such that you go get the the emphasis and the impact you are looking for. Oh, okay. So then that means right now in Ghana, the producer or the beat maker. The fee call in body know to as sound engineer yeah, yeah. because most of them go learn from YouTube and, mm. and all that. Mm. But is it bad for the same person to be called as so, I mean, the sound engineer will be mixed and mastered by the same person? You see, Ashman, eh, eh, you see, um, right now, eh, anybody feel get up. You see, the creative business that's the problem with the creative business, the creative business. The creative industry, you don't need certificate. You don't need any, um, uh, how do you, what's the word, uh, accreditation. We'll come to that one because I have issues there. But I want us to finish with this one. Okay, yeah, let's finish it. Uh -huh. 
You don't need any accreditation. It's like pastoral job, like the clergy. Anybody if you get out, they call themselves reverend. Anybody if you get out, they call themselves prophet, prophetess. You understand what yeah. I'm saying? So in this same way too, anybody if you get up, call himself, say, sounds yeah, and he gets away with it. Because, uh, <laughs> <most> <laughs> because plenty songs the mm-hmm. oh who makes them oh be me no do am. But I don't know if it depends on say go talk say a symmetry or that person or that man did it. You understand? They want to take all the credits. Like I, I play the beat and mix a master. Me nobody they mix a master my song. Go. And from I don't know. Is it cool? Is it cool? Oh, that's childish. That's childish. I mean, why do you take the glory for what you haven't done? I mean, uh, for me, I find that to be very childish. But some of them did really. They they, they it be them they mix and master. Them. Oh well, fine. If he mix and master, that be. But is it professional that one person plays the beats, he makes, he master, and all that? Is it professional? If he wants it professional, mm-hmm. it's 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 not really professional. I mean, you see, because there are rules. The, the producer is a rule. The sound engineer is a rule. Mm-hmm. There are two rules. There okay. are two different rules. They are not the same rule. Okay. There are two different rules. Mm-hmm. So if you want to play everything, you think you are up to. If 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 why why would you play a, a, a rule when you know you, are, you yourself you are not up to it? Maybe because of um, a budget okay. restrictions. Mm-hmm. So you would like and do everything himself, you know and. Most of the time, they seem to get away with it. But, but just restriction. Now, the marketing side of music is booming. So they are making money. So what stops the artist to invest? Oh, you are the producer. Yes, I know you are the producer. You can mean, I think Zap can do it. But as you produce, finish, make it take, go give Zap, make it mix and master. But the same person will talk, oh, no, I go feed do um. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, that, that that has always been a tendency with Ghanaians, as I've, I've known. Uh, this is not the first time. Is that how, when we started doing this, is that how it did, did go? Oh, then, them times have no. No, I mean, because the artist even doesn't have time to be doing all that. Because they, they get busy with other things. You know. But today, you find the artists having too much time on their hands. So they have the time to, you know. And that's why that's why it happens that they go into the studio and three hours, three hours they are done, they are done with, with, with the song. And they put it out. They put it out. And unfortunately, when they bring it to you guys, we play it. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, I the vibe with uh, the legendaries of Mallets. This be studio, studio day inside, but we just can't sit for in porch. Yeah. We they have some convo. It's about music. Yeah. It's about how to develop our arts as a whole. You know, be only producer. It the sync ways and the arts. But you, I go, I go bring that side. It the sync ways and the, it's not the right music too. Most of the songs they way in voices we take do, but I go ask some. So, boss, uh, back to uh, the same music discussion. Uh, our content, as the content we de- enjoy, because the beats they are fine day, but the message in the song, per what now we they hear before to what we they feel now, boss. What how you they see them? Oh, right now it be shallow. It be shallow. Uh, It'd be shallow, but you see, uh, Ashman, I don't really blame them um, when they ask me. As an elderly person, I, I look at the system. You look at the system and you look at the trend. Oh, now, hey, Tamo, uh, can I speak Ghana or three or whatever? Oh, let, make we speak, like make we blend them, our broken, yeah. everything. Make you just... see, make I tell you something. Um, the, 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 uh, somebody could talk, uh, oh, hey, you know, Una. The kind of person you be, it be mm-hmm. woman where you go get. So the kind of people we be, you know, it be artists not what they get. Ooh. You understand? Ooh. So the, well, because at the end of the day, the artists come from the society. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, they don't fall from the stars. They don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they are stars, but they don't from the fall from the stars. Yeah. They don't fall from the skies. They don't fall from heaven. Yeah. They, they are they are they are from society. So it's the kind of society that we have the of artists. artists would they get? They get? Yes. Because right now, society can't turn just entertainment. Everything be entertainment. Oh, okay. If you watch, even campus TV self, they, they do everything about, you check about 80% of their program is about entertainment. Mm-hmm. They don't have any education program, programs, even campus TV, university stations. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Maybe I may be wrong or I may be, or I may be right, but mm-hmm. from what I have seen, from where I'm coming from, there is nothing like that. 
It's all about entertainment. So the kind of generation you have is kind of churning out the artists that we are getting. Mm -hmm. So the artists don't, don't also think deep. They don't, they don't think deep. They are just like in Quanchena on the peripherals. They are just, just like the society has given us. That's the kind of artist we have. So the artist can't think deep because at the end of the day, if you think deep self, nobody's going to go along with you. Mm. Nobody's going to go with you because nobody understands even what you're going to say. Mm. Even now they can't give proverbs, they can't talk talk. So <laughs> we don't have time for that now. There, is a, there was a video circulating on social media mm -hmm. about uh, someone asking an artist. Yes, so you know, born on the answer, same be anymore. Or say, me na me too for. Oh, my no papa sati too for. You see the tendency. You see the tendency. And, and in a sense, he's, he, he has a point. He might not be right, mm -hmm. but he has a point because at the end of the day, he's in it to make money. Mm -hmm. So he's just going in for what people are just going to jump to and, and just make him make his money. And get, get. To help us? Well, hmm. as to helping us, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, you see, music is, is a matter of opinion. Mm -hmm. Lama, if you remember Lama, uh, if you get the message to the world, that guy. Okay. That, oh, you, you go know, if you hear his song, you know, say no harm. This British guy, uh, he's, an Igbo, he's an Igbo boy, but he was born in bred in Britain. Uh, he's called Lama. Okay. In the, in the 90s, he was quite big. So he's a Nigerian. He's a Nigerian, yes. That means the Nigerian started with the today. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lama, oh, Lama, check Lama. He said, he made a, a statement. He said, music is a matter of opinion. Okay. What goes sweet to you, you know? No, no go sweet me. Yeah, be true. Uh -huh. so, so, so on the, on the Lama, Lama discussion, uh, what's your take on Ghana and Nigeria music right now? Uh, uh, the Nigerians are serious. Serious as in? In every aspect. I asked for that one there. Let's not even go there. But even their technical side, the production side, they, mm. they do more. When I listen, I hear them. I hear Nigerian songs a lot. Okay. There used to be a spot where I go and sit and they put on this um, uh, DSTV. Charlie, Charlie. When you hear some of the songs, you know this is African, but it sounds, it sounds so rich. You know, it sounds so, so, so much of quality mm -hmm. is working here. Unlike ours, we you know uh, so regimented. Ours, when I hear our our, our, our sound, it sounds so regimented, so regimented. You know, so stiff. There's no movement to it. Is it a groove or the groove and everything. There is exactly that, that's the word. You know, I didn't want to use it, but once you mentioned it, that's the word. <laughs> the music even lacks groove. Trust me, the beat lacks groove. It's just there, bang, bang, bang like that. But when you listen to Nigeria, it has some groove that makes you want to. Enjoy. Bop your head, you know. Yeah. It go make you want to bop your head or tap your feet or something like that, you know. And Charlie, those guys are serious. Wow. Those guys are serious. Is it, is it not the fact that they they are financially sound than uh, so they invest more into their yeah, works? Yeah, probably, probably, uh, probably that could be a, 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 a reason. But I just think that sometimes take the, the the reason why is I say that is that we, the way we take the technology. Mm -hmm. That's also disturbing us. So the technology gives us what it gives us. No, no groove, no feeling. But they are also using but, the same technology. But, but they use, maybe they add more of the human creativity. To as we were discussing before. Yeah. Yes. They add more of the human, the human aspect be more than just using a computer. Okay. Okay. That's the difference. Okay. Uh -huh. So from you, the Nigerians are sounding better oh, than, yeah, yeah. than our yeah. songs. But I don't want to make it sound like that. Uh, but that's how, you know, because if you listen to some of our songs, let's say some songs, let's use 2000 to like, let's say 2007, 2010. Most of the songs we were, we were doing back then and the production compared to what we have now, it seems those ones sounds better than what we have now. Well, yes. I mean, if, if that is what it is, it, 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 it is. It is. I mean, that's why I'm saying that because of the human element. But you yourself, do you think it be true? Say they sound better past what we have now. Yeah, we, I know they expect to make a point, my father. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I won't make you tell me. <laughs> oh, of course. I mean, of course, yes. I'll say yes. I mean, 
because we that those times we took our time. Okay. You know, we took our time. Lord Kenya go can rap, he go go like one week before he go can pick in song. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? Sometimes two weeks before he go can pick in song. At that time, he's giving you all the time in the world to experiment and to put in everything you want to put in, express everything you want to express. You understand what I'm saying? So it's not like now, as as soon as he come, you know, they walk away. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I understand. So, so, boss, recently we, we, we had something online they called Behind the Hits. Yeah. And to shout outs to JQ, shout outs to Alodia, shout outs to all the Sarkodia and Co. Shout out to the crew behind that wonderful. Uh, uh, they were pairing, they paired all the producers, and I saw your flyer. But all of a sudden, they pull down your flyer, uh, all because he said you are not interested. Or the ones they are comparing you or pairing you to, it's not your match. Because uh, let's say it's not your match. Uh, I was like, oh, really? Okay. Uncle Zab is my boss, so I will ask him, boss, why did you come out and say, oh, no, it's so disrespectful? Why? Uh. I can only um, speak if what I said, mm -hmm. if, it was, if it wasn't true, fine. But as far as I'm concerned, what I said was true. I thought that, I, it's, not, it's not like I'm against the act to, okay. I, no, no, the event, I think it was nice. I think it's okay. Uh, it's, a, it's a nice event and everything. But I just thought that, look, it was just a bit too much for me to be, to be to be put inside this yeah. thing, yes, okay. yes, because I just thought that look, if the if the, if you guys want to play, play, don't add me to it. Like I didn't like the event. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I mean, I didn't watch it. I didn't get to watch it. I didn't have time to watch it okay. myself. But I don't think there's anything. Wrong. I didn't have a pro any bit of a any bit of a problem with it. No, I just felt that it wasn't my thing. It's not me. Uh, it will be unfair to place me against somebody who, when I was um, producing hits, he was now in school. He was now, you know, carrying books up wow. and down school. Okay. You know, I, I just think, because uh, you see, what I said, I was explaining to somebody that, look, what I said, I didn't even say it as Zabmalet alone. I said it for the whole industry. Okay. Because I was thinking that if DJ Ashman kept mm -hmm. one day, one day, at a certain age, after everything you've done for the industry, I kept mm -hmm. Compare some Mukune by inside there, no, I know it, but yes, you trained him, or even he picked it from you. You don't like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You, yes. So, I mean, it was something that I said, not only because I was speaking as a mallet, mm -hmm. but I was speaking as a total, because even he said, or to say, strong man, who are. How will you feel? How will you feel? You understand what I'm saying? Is, is, it, is, it, but, but is it not the fact that, like, is it not like, you have issue with Sarkodie no, or no, something? No, 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 I don't have. In fact, do you want me to tell you something? Tell me. Sarkodie is my best rapper for now. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. I've said it in a couple of interviews. Okay. He's the best rapper for me. For me, I, 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 anytime I hear his rap, I may not even pay attention to the contents of what he's saying. Oh, and people say that oh, nah, nah, he repeats himself. Mm -hmm. I don't even feel that. All I care about is his voice and his delivery. Mm -hmm. That's all I care about. You understand what I'm saying? I don't have any problem. No, 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 no. DJ Ashman, don't get me wrong. I don't have any problem. It's not possible. It's true. Yeah. So, uh, talking about recordings, Zap Mallet, mm -hmm. have you recorded any of the new guys, like the new guys we have today? Oh, no, 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 no. I haven't. Uh, I haven't. I haven't had opportunity yet. To. Oh, why? Yeah. Um, I, are they not reaching out to you? Or you know? They are not reaching out. They are not reaching out. Um, most especially, I think, I've been also marketed and hyped. Overhyped in the system, I think. Like I, you have been overhyped, you. Too expensive. Oh, how? So yes, yes, that's that's that's. But that's music is expensive. Well, that, but that's what I get, I get around. You know, a Ghanaian doesn't want to invest in music, you know. So, you know, wow. yeah. Wow. So, wow. so that's how it is, you know. But but I was on. Don't forget, I was on party and bullshit. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Tell us. Party that Sarkodie is tuned. Yes, yes. I was on it. Oh, really? Yes. I'm credited as songwriter and producer. I'm on that track. Yeah, Universal. But how many, how many people know? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, to be honest, no, 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 no. To be honest, because uh, when the whole thing happened, I haven't heard anybody going like, oh, Zap, or what record is Sarkodie and you and you? 
The new one cry. Oh, oh, okay. I, I produce it and then they they they, they, they finish it in London with Idris and uh, and uh, oh, Donnie okay. and the rest. But I produce I produce it here in the studio and then it was Mark. So me and Mark are even um, credited as songwriters and producers. On oh that. really? Yes, yes, on that track. You know, was last year. Yeah, just last year. Yeah. So, but I did I did that thing. I did that production long before last year. I, did, I think uh, a couple of years back. For the same track. For, for the, the same song. Yes, the same track that. Uh, that he did, yes, oh. the same song. Oh wow, wow! Because yes. it's one, it's on one of the sites we, yes, uh, yes. we normally buy our hip hop songs yes. and all that. So, so, I so, I'm, so I'm still around. Eh? The party and boo, whatever. Yeah, you yeah. can still do something for the new guys. So why are they not coming? That's uh, the problem. Well, yes, like I said, I, Ashman, Charlie, you can't run it from. I've been touted as too expensive. We won't, we can be, are you are you expensive? I'm not. I am not. I am the most. Trust me, I'm the most. Um, Understanding and, and the most gullible engineer in the whole country. Mm. That you come and tell me your story and come and sing to me a nice thing. I will, I will, I will not my, I will just, you know, but it doesn't mean that you come with empty hands. But now, <laughs> big very empty hands. Uh, yeah. Because most of the producers are complaining, oh, you know, they pay we, oh, these artists, we just play for them, they will go, then go hit, you know, they carry you, they know they pay and all that. Uh, uh, it, and it, it's, it's true, it, um, it, it's true, but I, I hope. Now, now the now the beat makers are, uh, and the producers. I hope now they are seeing what, because you see what happened was that yes, okay. they were doing it for the artists for free because they want name. Okay. So you do, and when you do it once, twice, that's it. Work, aka, aka. You will forever be a freelance. You will forever be doing it for free. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. okay. But here's the case with with marketing. Mm -hmm. I have uh, with if you you submit your song. Mm -hmm online and all that mm -hmm. you feel the form or you feel somewhere mm -hmm. that uh, whoever has contributed to the song in name good day there and all that right mm -hmm. and definitely if copyright and mm -hmm. small royalties I remember, but royalties. you think they, put, they, they will put somebody's name there like you were saying right now that some artists back and back and like mix no piano <laughs> how can they easy putting them for yeah, me but it falls to maybe zap do a song for instance the party and bullshit with Sarkodie. Definitely, if something come out, I know you get your, mm -hmm. your small coin out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. But that's that's how it's supposed to be. Uh -huh. But the thing is that they don't do it. Even well, if, even if he didn't pay you for the production. No, no, no. They don't. They won't do it. They don't even give you the credits, so that for you to even get in the coins. They won't oh, even do so it. The credit will only be like if you go online and you type so so and so song produced by that song. Yeah, that's but all, when you go to uh, document yeah, yeah, like the things that uh, Charlie, sometimes it doesn't it doesn't work like that. And the, the the beat makers and the producers are right to complain. But the thing is that it's just like the artists complaining mm -hmm. that we are not getting real artists mm -hmm. because Lala didn't talk and more for free. Ona, Lala didn't talk and more for free. Okay, okay, more for free. How do you expect people to buy it? Mm -hmm. you yeah. complain, okay, oh, Charlie, I know they get money out of it. Oh. I know they get money out of it. Oh. Yeah. But the thing is, okay, like I mentioned, okay, you're going to put a song online for free. For free. Yeah, how do you expect people to come and buy it? <laughs> anyway, anyway, Charlie, we still vibe with Zap Mallet. We're there in studio right now. So, boss, what's new for Zap Mallet? What's new for Zap Mallet? Mm. Uh, Production wise. Oh, Zap Mallet, they just, they, they just they hang around. They just they hang around. They do, do some one or two things. Uh, uh, well, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm still producing. Uh, I still do, uh, but I do a lot of mixing these days. Mixing these days. Uh, okay, so, so that means the young chaps, the young beat yeah, producers. I get, I get files, you know. They, they bring me files. Oh, okay. Yeah, but mostly it's um, live kind of thing. Oh. The live stuff. People bring me live so stuff. Apart from live, you know, they do any. Oh, I do. I do. I do. I do, I do, I do, I do oh, yeah. Okay. I do everything. Only say I slow. So then that, yeah, that's how you slow small. That's how you slow small. Is you know, it because you know make them see say you, you they do you they do that thing too? So nobody say oh Brana Zap and Bobby Bell make Zap play everything for you. But what do you what will be tough for me to make some master now? Uh, you see you see these days Ashman uh, everything be digital everything be online and uh, when it comes to that now, I've been very lazy there I've not been mm. I've not been so digital I've not digitalized my my craft properly mm. so. Okay. So, uh, so yes, yes, I think so. That one, yeah, I mean, there's nobody to blame for it because uh, I've been able to keep up with, you know, technology as it is, like, you know, 
because sometimes uh, I've I've tried a few times, you know, I've tried a few times to try to keep up, but sometimes uh, Charlie Mo usually uh, Charlie uh, over. And, yeah. uh, uh, the thing is that I will need a team to work with. You can't do it by yourself. And up to, up to now, I haven't had a team. That's why? why? I don't know. I don't know why. Yeah. But I've seen some couple of guys around. Oh, they are all they are all useless. Just. Like <laughs> but yeah, we can we can just put them up. They are as useless as as <laughs> as their own their, their own boss. So. <laughs> anyway, that's our mallets and Charlie in studio day than so man. In, if you are a producer, you have a song, and you need a professional mixing and mastering hands on your work, don't hesitate to yeah, hit him up. Yeah, he will do that for you, Charlie. Make you people know slack because the Nigerians they are not doing anything better than us, but they just ah. have the ears. Ah. So from my conversation with him, what I realize is we don't have professional hands in our projects. That we all. So ah, but Charlie Boss, the time where we would they produce for those 2003, 2004, 2005 time, where were the Nigerians? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where were they? You know, be now that they do uh, 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 this uh, where a hey, uh, bumper to bumper them. No, be that time where they start bumper to bumper. Uh, no, be uh, uh, they, 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 they. Jaga, jaga. Ah, jaga, jaga. Ah, Nigeria, hey, jaga, jaga. Things they do. The time where they do heavy productions and things. So no, be anything strange where they get where we don't get. Only say. Yeah, it's like of late. No, we know they take our time. Mm -hmm. Yes, but if we take our time, I think we'll be better. So what be, what would be your final words for the new guys, the new generation, beat producers, songwriters, and all that? Oh, make the hum humble themselves and learn better and learn more. Okay. The job, no learn finish. Mm -hmm. Myself, I still learn. There are a lot of things I still learn. Okay. But we know learn finish. And if something is, is uh, maybe if you reach somewhere where I just, uh, yeah, yeah, I didn't know edge, edge, there are people you can, you can fall on to ask. We are not dead. We are still alive. And once we are there with you, the best you can do is to make good use, good use of us. Yes. Mm. Well, 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 Charlie. We will love end the whole conversation for you. My name is DJ Ashman. I divide with Zap Malet. Charlie. So you know more things about Ghana music and what they happen.